Using your brain to win. Hi, I'm Holly G. Green, the architect of PAUSE, thinking to thrive expert and author of the new book, Using Your Brain to Win. You know, if you think today's business world moves so fast that you struggle just to keep up, much less get ahead, blame it on your brain. The human brain, that 2.5 pound blob of matter that lives inside our skulls, evolved in a very different environment than the one we live in today. As a result, the way we process information and make decisions doesn't always fit today's fast-paced world. In fact, our brains have a number of built-in biases, thinking patterns, and ways of seeing the world that actively get in the way of achieving success. To win in business, we need to learn new and different ways of using our brains. For example, in today's hyper-paced markets, we need to constantly seek out diverse sources of data, explore possibilities, and look for new and better ways of working. But our brains have a natural tendency to hold on to the past. In particular, they want to hold on to what made us successful in the past. However, few things pose more risk to today's businesses than clinging to the notion that what made you successful so far is going to keep doing so in the future. These days, markets can change in the blink of an eye. And if you don't change with them, your customers will quickly leave you behind. Here's another example. The brain has a built-in tendency to see what it wants to see and ignore what it doesn't fit its preconceived notions about the way the world works. As a result, we don't just accidentally overlook data that contradicts our point of view. We go out of our way to deny it. And the more a new idea or data point threatens our prevailing view of the world, the harder the brain works to reject it, even in the face of overwhelming evidence to the contrary. Fortunately, there are a lot of things we can do to counteract some of the brain's inclinations to sabotage our success. Slow down to go fast. Expose your thinking to other people. Pause to examine and challenge the thought bubbles that you have. Give up the quest to find the one right answer. Let go of what made you successful in the past. The hard part is that most of these solutions are counterintuitive to what we think might be the right thing to do. When we're running as fast as we can to keep up, the last thing we want to do is slow down and ask ourselves, is there another way to look at this? We don't want to take the time to gather new data or disconfirming data before we run again. But if we don't check in with our brains on a regular basis and discard those old ways of thinking, you could end up running the wrong race. And today's markets are not nearly as forgiving as they used to be. Make one critical mistake and you may never catch up. And that's why I wrote Using Your Brain to Win, to provide today's business leaders with a roadmap for using their brains more effectively and setting your organization up to win. You can get your copy on Amazon.com or on our website, morethanaminute.com. These days, everyone has access to game-changing information and technology. Competitive advantage comes today from becoming more aware of how we think and make decisions, and actively taking steps to overcome your brain's built-in ways of thinking that undermine your efforts to win.